So uh, the problem that we are trying to address is uh, how to treat you know, a patient who has been bitten by a snake. Uh, the existing treatments are primarily based on use of plasma or horse blood plasma is not a very stable uh, molecule or stable substance and hence has to be stored uh, in facilities that are generally limited in large hospitals. So what that means is that if somebody gets bitten, you know, in a jungle or a, or a village, there will be quite a bit of time by the time, you know, they get treated with the present therapies. Uh, the second problem is that uh, the existing treatments are quite expensive. So a typical plasma based treatment would cost you several thousand rupees. A third issue is that since you are injecting you know the horse blood plasma it has other components in it besides the actual molecule that is uh, working against the snake venom so as a result of that there are a lot of cases where patients see major side effects from these uh, reactions so uh, in compared to this the molecule that we are trying to use it's a peptide which is basically a very small chain of amino acids and uh, this molecule is quite stable so it can be stored at room temperature for years uh, plus being a peptide there are likely going to be minimal side effects to the patient. So I think on all these three fronts, uh, we think that the treatment that we are trying to create uh, would be far more effective than present treatments. Several lakh people die every year in India, you know, because of snake bites. So we thought it's a pretty big problem. And also we saw that there is actually no other company right now working on any alternative. So everybody is uh, just basically using this serum based treatment. And I don't, you know, we are not aware of any major company that is trying to create an alternate solution. Right now we are, we have tested it against uh, a few snake venom in breads. And so far it looked, uh, it, it worked well. The next stage that we are actually in the middle of doing right now is to testing it against even more snake venoms basically all the five major snake venoms that are found in India uh, and again this testing will be done in rats once this phase is over and depending on the results if the results are good then the next step for us is to collaborate with a major biotech company and go into human trials